Looks like you're a pretty fucking dangerous person to be around, Avi. First you kill my friend, then you get me and my friends on Joan's shit list? I think you need to give us some space, Javi. Fuck that. I don't want to see you ever again. Well, maybe I'd be better off with Joan. At least I know she wants to stab me in the back. You get the fuck out and you stay gone, or I can't be held accountable. You feel me? We could take care of ourselves. Hell, we stick around you much longer. You'll probably kill us too. I'm sorry it happened the way it did. Really. Conrad wasn't a bad guy. The situation was just... just fucked. We better go get that truck. I'll, uh, get my stuff. Then call you on the walkie when I see things getting started in the square. You come with me to get the truck. Gabe and Kate, you guys hang back here. Be ready for anything. I see what's going on. You're punishing me because I told everyone what you did, right? Screw that. I'm going to get the truck. You stay behind and keep watch. Keeping watch is an important job, too. Not as important as getting that truck. Hey, Gabe. Come on. I need you to watch my back on this one. Yeah. Okay. What? Nothing. Gabe and I will be fine back here. I guess they'll be using that for construction once they've cleared this area. There it is. Let's go. Chances. I'd say about 50 50. Smart ass. They say how long it's going to take the men to finish up here. These people keep getting pushed onto other projects. They're mostly honest. Hell yeah. This graveyard shift is killing me. Oh, let me get some air. Early risers. Come on, we got to hurry and finish before more people wake up. What are we going to do? Can't start the engine, not without attracting a lot of attention. Kate, you steer. The rest of us are going to get behind the truck and push. See if we can't get some distance between us and them. Ready? Ready. Ready. Remember that 
Turns out you needed me after all, huh? I'm just saying, I know you didn't want me to come along. If I'd stayed behind, maybe we wouldn't have been able to get the truck. You know, I'm just trying to keep you safe, don't you? Uh, yeah, but... But nothing. <laughs> you want to keep doing stuff like this, you got to learn how to follow directions. Don't think those guys will be able to hear the engine all the way over here. I put it in neutral. Couldn't find an ignition key in there. Guess you'll have to hotwire it. Try not to shock yourself. Shit. I'll need something to strip the wires. They left all their supplies lying around. Bet there'll be some tools out there somewhere. Just try to hurry, okay? there. Keep an eye out while I get it started, okay? I'll check on the guys in the office. Clem and I will look out for walkers. Okay. Here goes. Wire cutters should help with this. Connect the battery to the ignition. Let there be light. The square is a couple of blocks away. This is a good place to wait. Do we have enough gas? I'm not about to turn the engine off again. What now? We wait for Ava to call us on the walkie. So, nothing for us to do but sit and watch the sun come up. Well, I know we've got something important to do. I'm teaching you to play Euchre. <sighs> That's not a real thing. It's a card game. Come on, it's fun. It's nice to be driving around with a couple kids in the back seat again. Really takes you back, doesn't it? Just you and me and Gabe and Mari. Better times. You're right. This is nice. Like if I just close my eyes, we're right back where we were. All of us together. Do what I do. Try to think about the nice stuff. Not everything that happened after. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, come on. That's not even a good rule. Still gotcha. Guess he stopped playing it cool with her. Hmm? Uh, 
In case you haven't noticed, Gabe's got a little crush on Clementine. He light likes her. You get it? Well, okay, I sort of am. Okay, so I'm gonna do I hope it works out for them. I really do. They're good for each other. I think. I think their first official date will be target practice. Then skinning and eating a wild animal. Ugh, young love. It's so normal, you know? Like, as crazy as things get, as terrible and tragic and just plain stupid, there's nothing more wonderfully ordinary as two kids falling for each other. Not that they're there yet, but to feel something that intensely for another person, kind of like the best drug there is. Well, one of the best drugs. When I was his age and I liked a girl, I was a fucking wreck. Sweaty palms and stomach aches. And... Boners behind math books? We knew. Every time, we knew. Sadie? Hell on earth. It's unfair, that's all I'm saying. That they're feeling what they're feeling right now, and... When that sun gets a little higher, it's right back to the fight. I just wish he could have had a childhood, you know? I wish I could have given them that. Him and Mari, both. They deserved better than this. Better than what got handed to them. That's why we're doing this thing, right? So he can have a better life after everything's said and done? You're right. I know you're right. I hope you know, Javi. Having you there with me, right by my side, all this time... That's what made the difference. You're so sure of what you're doing all this for. You didn't run away. You could have. But you didn't. I think that's just you know, who I am, you know? Not who I am now, at least. I get it. There's no graceful way to say this, so I'm just gonna say it. I know we've had moments, you and I. And they're always a little hot and a little confusing and maybe some of them haven't meant anything at all. But before whatever happens tomorrow, happens I need you to know whatever this thing is between us I want to give it a chance and I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more complicated but do you feel the same way I'd really like to know before things get crazy we might not get another chance no pressure or anything, all right? Well, maybe I should have stayed quiet. Let's go for it. We gotta try, right? Oh my god, really? Really. So are we gonna... Okay. Yeah. Shit. We're doing this. You do realize we're gonna have to have a weird conversation with David, right? It's the right way to play this. He already got the sense I was pulling away. I just want to be able to tell him in person. It'll feel better that way. I hope he can handle it. I know he's good under pressure, but this is different. Yeah. Here's hoping he doesn't completely flip out. Considering we're about to save his life, maybe he'll cut us a break. Javi! It's an execution over here. She's planning to hang David in front of the whole crowd. You've got to get over here, now. Don't bring the truck. If they see it, they'll kill him right away. If you can just get into the square... Shit. We got to get over there. Now. I'm going to hang back here, with the truck. Keep the walkie close by. We'll tell you as soon as we've got David. Good luck. 
Nothing else from Ava? Nope. And it sounds like a crowd out there. It sounded like Ava got cut off by something. Or somebody. Wish we had some idea of what we're heading into. Like, is the whole plan shot? Or did she just have a little setback? I hate not knowing. We can't get distracted. I don't know what happened on the other side, but it doesn't change what we have to do. I just wish we had a little more information, that's all. We're not gonna know what went wrong until we actually do this thing. So, let's do it already. You ready? We just have to remember, not everyone in Richmond is a bad person. You're right. We're not trying to hurt anyone out there. At least, not anyone who's on our side. for the others, can we? For years now, Richmond has been governed by one simple principle. Strong council, strong community. But, unfortunately, the actions of one of the members of that council, our security expert, David Garcia, have put us all She's in... She's lying to all of you! I'm sorry to have to show you this. Truly, I am. But you all need to see. Just look what he's done. David ordered his brother and the rest of his people to kill our doctor. And they were happy to do it. Is this who we want in charge? Someone this reckless, this cruel? Not if I have anything to do with it. I can't believe this is really happening. She's gonna kill him. She can't do this to him. He's kept him safe. I think she's bluffing. It's a scare tactic. There's no way she's really gonna execute David. Are you sure? I hope you're right. Javier! I heard you were planning to crash our little party. Why did you come on up here? Show your face to everyone. I'm sure these people would like to hear what you have to say. Don't make me ask twice. Happy to. Been waiting for this all day. Then I'll try not to disappoint you. We both know you killed Dr. Lingard. Why, Harvey? Why would you do that to us? The only surgeon in a hundred mile radius, but you didn't care about that. You thought he deserved to die. Lingard saw what was happening in Richmond, what you were trying to do, and he didn't want any part of it. He asked me to spare him the sight of all this. You ask me, he's better off. Sorry if I don't take your word for it. Too bad you killed the only man who could back up your story. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend, Eleanor, last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? We did. She said you were coming here today to take me out. Add to your total. Don't know how you thought you were going to pull it off, considering it's all of us against the three of you. But I guess hope springs eternal. And that's exactly what I'm planning to do. Appreciate the honesty. Which makes this so much harder. Here in Richmond, people who put themselves before the group don't last long. Bring them out. Get away from me. You're making a mistake. Ava! Oh, no. They had them this whole time. David wanted to tear this whole place down. He told his people where to find our gun supply, and sure enough, they picked us clean. You really thought you could ride into town and stage a coup? With our own damn weapons? Something like that? 
I can't just let it go. You've put me in a no-win situation here. So I'm gonna do the same thing to you. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. No! Hell no! Joan! Don't! Not after what they tried to do. You may be guilty of bringing them into this, but they chose to go along with it. Is this the kind of leadership you've got in store for Richmond? Torturing people with your stupid power games? Justice isn't a game, Javi. It's about time you learn that. Joan, are you sure about this? We never agreed to killing all these people. It's really up to Javi, isn't it? All eyes are on you. Maybe this will help you make up your mind. Boys? <gasps> Come on, Javi. Who's it gonna be? Your friend? Or your brother's lieutenant? Oh, come on! This is fucking stupid! You can't be serious. God damn you, Joe. Do the right thing, Javi. How could you do this? Trip has to live. He's invaluable. Son of a bitch. Javi, what the fuck is wrong with you? You're not making David happy. But I respect you for sticking up for your own people. Shoot him. Wait! I said Trip should live! You did, but there's something else you need to understand. Betrayal. You can't do this! Oh, fucking figures. I can do anything I want. You brought this on yourself. Do it. Wait! No! No! Oh my god. They really shot him. Oh god damn it. Now, David, it's your turn. I can't believe this. This isn't how we do things. This is madness! Stop her, Clint! Is this the process you trusted? No! Think about this, Javi. You know what's gonna happen here. You ready for that? We don't murder in Richmond. We exile. That's how we've always done things. How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? Go far away from Richmond, and then whatever you do is up to you. I'm sure the herd outside would like that. She thinks she's sending us out there to die. She's counting on it. Everybody, put your guns away. We're gonna handle this peacefully. Ah. Don't listen to them, Javi. They're fucking butchers, all of them. Shoot that bitch. Take her out. She deserves it. If you don't do it, I fucking will. Let me out of here! I'll tear her apart! Go to hell, Joan! Me. We gotta make things right. Oh, okay. Dad needs us. We gotta get out there. He needs you, not me. Go on. Thanks.
a way out of this hobby. Why did you have to go and shoot her? <laughs> Shit, get down! I hear gunfire! What the hell is going on over there? Are you guys okay? Do you need a pickup? Stay away from the square! It's too risky. We'll come to you. I... I can't hear you! It's too loud. God! Javi, you've got to get over there before... While we're still breathing, Javi, I'm letting the bones speak to me. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I think I can hear them. They're saying, You're gonna lose, come mierda, so play already. I must have inherited patience from Ma. Oh, come on, man. Calm down, David. No one is ever in a rush to lose. My beard. Victoria. Carajo. I was so close. You're now my least favorite son, Javier. Hey, he's the one who beat you. Fine. It's a tie. I hate you both equally. Kicked out of baseball. Can't play dominoes. What exactly are you good at again, Javi? At least I can actually play baseball. Slugger. That's enough, both of you. It's not Javi's fault he's a disgrace to the game of dominoes. I won. That's ten bucks you owe me. Both of you. I know you're broke, Javi. You should sit out the next game, since we all know I'm gonna win. No shame in surrender. You'd all understand. Now, don't break your hand patting yourself on the back. I'll beat you next time. Should you even be betting on these games? Isn't that what got you in trouble to begin with? Do we need to have an intervention? Now, keep on talking, David. See what happens. Hey, hey, this is Domino's. 
Winning means you get to be a little bit of a pendejo. <laughs> Pay up, little brother, if you can. I'll cover for Javier. Oh, is it your turn to do that now? I lost track. Poor, helpless Javi. Get my wallet, mijo. Keep an eye on him. You don't want him snatching an extra 20 for gas money. It's on the counter. Yeah, sure, Pa. Pa? What's this? Hey, man, I was reading that. What? Wait, what's up? What the fuck is this? None of your business. He has cancer. What? Bob, really? I'm old. Old people get cancer. You didn't need to know. That's not for you to decide! Oh my god! Are you okay? I mean, are you in pain? I'm not happy I lost a game that I knew I should have won. Ah, oh, come on. How bad? It's okay, mijo. Ask me. How bad is it? You won't have to worry about paying me back that ten bucks. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Pa. Please, settle, David. Now. You haven't told Mama. And neither will either of you. You hear me? Mouth shut. That's not okay, Pa. You have to tell her. <sighs> when the time is right, I, I will. That's not good enough. It's good enough for me. You're gonna need her help with this, Pa. Driving you to the doctor, getting prescriptions. Wait, what are your options? Treatment, stuff like that. Chemo, radiation. All that expensive mierda. Great. When do you start? I turned it down. Turned it down? You don't get to turn it down. So much money and for what? Another month. Another game of dominoes to lose. It's not worth it. If I was still playing ball, I could have paid for it. I'll pay for it. It's not happening. Save your money. Fuck the money. I can afford it. You can afford it, David. But my pride can't. Let's play another game. You are a fucking coward! A selfish coward! Javi, can you believe this shit? What the fuck, David? Apologize now! Sit down. Both of you. You know, I pray for daughters. Every night your mother was pregnant with both of you. Please, God, a daughter. Anything but a son. Anything but another me. Anything but another hot-headed idiot with his heart in the right place. Anything but another foolhardy, handsome gambler. Anything at all. Please, Papa. Don't give up. Fight. Fight for our name, for our blood, for our family. Please, fight. You have to fight, Pa. We don't just give up, any of us. Okay. Okay? Okay. I'll think about it. Oh, thank you, Pa. Thank you, Avi. Now can we play another game? I'll grab some more beers. So, what are you really gonna do? Truth be told, whatever gets your mother off my ass. You think you two were mad at me for keeping secrets? Hm. But it's good to see you and David on the same side of things, or a change. I'm gonna be a name carved in stone before you know it, Javier. That'll be me. Letters on a rock that nobody wants to visit. I know you think you're strong enough to handle that alone. And so does your brother. And you're both wrong. You have to take care of each other. You two are all I'll leave behind. Like Gabe and Mariana will be for David. Legacy, Javier. It's all anyone leaves behind. That and their... bones. 
be brothers before it's too late. That's not too much to ask. One last favor for your old man. Okay, Pa. I'll try. As hard as you can? As... as hard as I can. I still need to pay, David. Pa. Oi, if you had just won the game, we wouldn't have had this problem. <laughs> so you're blaming me for all this? I'm depending on you, mijo. We both are. here she must have gotten out if something's happened to her if you've gotten her you better hope she's alive I thought you didn't want me around anymore forget about that Kate 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 David wait So glad Harvey, you're... thank God you're all right. I'm just glad you're still in one piece. Thanks for making it back to me. Huh. Nice driving back there. You know, if you'd swerved a little more, you would have actually hit me. Dang. <laughs> I'll make sure not to miss next time. What's the matter with you two? Focus on your surroundings. There's Gabe and Clem. Lead the way, hubby. Get the knee, like this. Nice. I got a great teacher. You guys all right? Yeah. I'm fine. Look at them! There's so many! We'll be safer inside! Get in! That should hold them for now. You put up a good fight out there. Hey, Dad. I'm glad you made it out. Joan's probably looking for us. No, she isn't. Javi shot her. What? Good riddance. You were negotiating. I heard you. 
You didn't have to shoot. Everyone started panicking and shooting. We almost died. You know what Joan's done. Prescott, Mariana, they're gone because of her. I couldn't trust her to keep her word. We'll never know now. Bobby's right. Joan had to go. I would have done it too. That's because you don't mind killing people, do you? Those dead guys, they were your friends. Gabe, that's not fair. Hey, you do not walk away from me. When someone speaks to you, you stand up and answer them, even if you don't want to. David, that's enough. He's not a little boy. He doesn't need that from you. What he needs is to learn to keep his opinions to himself until he understands what the hell he's talking about. I'm just... I'm trying to protect you, Gabe. I lost you once. I won't let it happen again. Okay? We made it through alive. Let's just be glad about that. We need to check the other entrances. Make sure we're safe. Gabe, want to help me out? Javi? Gabriel! Go help him, Gabe. It's okay. He doesn't need your permission. I'll help too. O okay. Hey, Clem is with them. It's fine. It's not that. It's... let's just... <sighs> I'm all over the place. I need to focus on something. Anything. Just need to focus. On whatever. Let's just go upstairs. The further we are from these doors, the happier I'll be. I just want to get as much distance between us and the Muertos as I can. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Oh my god. This is a fucking nightmare. Mommy, it's them. I'm glad Mariana didn't live to see this. To see what her father's become. To see what I've done. She'd be just like that little boy. Scared that the monsters are coming after her next. She would never trust us again. And I wouldn't blame her. Kate, come on. We're not monsters. I don't know who we are anymore. But it's not the people she knew. I did this to them. That hole is there because of me. This is all my fault. I'm just as responsible for it as you are. You weren't behind the wheel, Javi. It's different. I can't leave until I make this right. All of this. Let's fix this as best we can. All right, Kate. Let's make things right. I don't know if it's actually possible, but I feel a lot better knowing you're there, too. Trip was my best friend, Javi. He died because of you. He didn't deserve this. You have no one to blame but yourself. Your actions betrayed Trip. And to think of how much he cared about you. I never thought it would be like this. You have to believe that. Everyone but Prescott is dead. Everyone but me. What's done is done. I don't have to like it. 
But I can't change it. But you... You've got a lot of nerve showing up here. After the bullshit you pulled! You're unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Oh, oh, I've got a lot of nerve. Everything that happened is because of you. This is all your fault. I told you, I wanted you out of my life after what you did to Conrad. Why did you tell Joan what we were doing? I was triaging a bad situation. Their doctor is dead. And before you guys fucked it up, their walls worked. It's not only about me. I can actually save lives here. Not just stitch them up and hope for the best. These people will die without me, Javi. I know she, well, fucked us over. But she's trying to help them. She's trying to make something right. That's worth forgiving, right? She's trying. That counts. Eleanor is one of us. Maybe she forgot it. But I haven't. Thank you, Javi. We should try to help. Not everyone here is guilty. Fern. Is that you, darling? I'm here, handsome. Fern and Rufus. What's wrong with him? Bitten. He's slipping in and out of delirium. We have to find Ida. We have to find our daughter. I... I know, hon. I know that guy. We had a... situation. He's lucky I didn't shoot him. Looks like his luck just ran out. Let them have a minute. It's the least we can do. Y'all get over here! You gotta... cut his arm off! It's too far along. I'm sorry. Bullshit! It can work! I've seen it! Do you want his last moments alive to be more painful than they need to be? I just want to try. I can't lose everyone. Please. I'm begging you. Please. I'll try. Hand over that axe. Thank you. Don't thank me yet. you he was too far along the bloodlust didn't help either i'm sure i'm sorry i tried <laughs> showed up. We're dead fucking meat, David. Might as well take out this asshole while I can. Fern. Shut up! I didn't mean for this to happen. I'm so sorry about your daughter. You can apologize to her face in just a second. Dan down. That's an order. Katie, no! Fern, this is all because of me. I caused the explosion. I killed your daughter. Please, forgive me. It's my fault. Please. I am begging you. I hardly have any family left. Please don't take any more away from me. <sighs> no! Burn! Holy Burn! shit! Oh my god! Oh my god! Dad! You're welcome, Javi. That dead guy! 
David, what are you doing? This isn't right. David! Oh, my God. This is unacceptable. She wasn't going to shoot. Believe me, she was. Because I would have. No! David! Gabe! I, I, I'm sorry, that was an accident. You were going to kill her. She was going for her gun. Look at her. Gabe, I'm... She can't even stand up. What the hell is wrong with you? He was just being safe, Gabe. That doesn't mean she has to die. That isn't the answer for everything. Gabe. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to do that to you. You know that. Why the hell are you all looking at me that way? They're just... They're scared, David. Of what? I'm protecting them. Then why are you pointing a gun at us? So I'm all alone. Fine then. You people are on your own. Such an asshole. I've seen that look in his eyes before. You should go after him. David? What are you doing? That's a long way down. You'll fall fast, but you'll fall all the same. Come over here. Or are you afraid of me too? I know the rest of them are. Right? I'm a lot more afraid of falling. And I'm even more afraid of landing. There's nothing to be afraid of. It'd be over in an instant. My wife, Javi. My son. They look at me differently. Maybe you're seeing them differently. I want to show you something. Stand with me. Uh, why the hell are you smiling? See that sewer line over there? Perfect placement for a trench. That hill, about a hundred paces west of it. Sniper's wildest dream come true. I'm a soldier, Javi. I see this landscape like a painter sees a blank canvas. Like how you used to see a baseball diamond. I'm a soldier. This makes sense to me. I was made for this. I thrive in this. Baseball was a lifetime ago. I miss it so fucking much. When I wasn't deployed, I'd miss being out in the field. Now that's all I am. Every day. A soldier isn't a husband. Or a father. A soldier is a soldier. Nothing else. Nothing. Nothing at all. Call yourself whatever you want. I still see you as my brother. That is kind of you to say, Javi. I wish... I wish I had your heart sometimes. I want to change, Javi. I always have. Really? All you ever tried to do was get me to change. <sighs> Only because I couldn't bring myself to do it first. It's the one war I could never win. And I'm wondering why. Is it because... I don't know how, or because it's impossible to change who you really are. There's a way. There always is. No matter how lost you are, you just have to keep looking until you find it. Looks pretty messy. For now. Maybe you're right. Maybe. Just gotta live long enough to find out. Just like with anything else. 
I did what you asked. You did. Thanks for that. So now, will you step back? <sighs> sure. Be careful, Javi. I ran into... She was still outside when we checked on the entrances. There were muertos everywhere. We got her inside just in time. Seriously, I've never seen so many muertos. Oh, it's awful out there. That was the right thing to do. Proud of you, buddy. Ava, uh, about earlier... I guess I owe you an explanation about what happened on the stage with Joan and Tripp. You don't have to say anything to me. Your actions said plenty. I read you loud and clear, but go ahead and say whatever you want. Hey, don't get mad at me. It was a total no-win scenario. Just be glad the situation was what it was, and that she didn't make me pick between you and your brother. There's so many. They're pouring in. You don't know the half of it. The herd has taken over Richmond. The streets are filled with walkers. With that hole in the wall, this city is fucked. We're not safe here. No one is. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck have we done? So what do we do? I don't want to die up here. None of us do, Gabe. Stabilize the city. Figure out how to make it safer for everyone. I saw construction vehicles when we got the armored truck. We can use those to stop the Muertos, seal the breach, and save Richmond. That's over by the motor pool at the water tower. We could use the highway overpass to get to the water tower. Come on. Let's jump. <sighs> Come on, it's an easy jump. <clears throat> Keep your eyes open, stay aware of your surroundings, all of you. Let's move out. When we found Kate earlier, she hugged you. Why do you think she hugged you? Why was that? Just wondering. You really want to know? Then ask her. She won't even make eye contact with me. Careful up here, or else the exact same thing will happen to us. Stay sharp and do not fire your guns. We're gonna be fine. That guy was all alone. We're not. <laughs> Everyone, hold back. Let Javi and I clear out these walkers. Move. You okay, bud? <laughs> 